At least this isn't like Forsaken Fortress and Wind Waker HD where you literally cannot be caught. Otherwise you get sent back a while. That's annoying. <laughs> Excuse me. Wait. Come to my spring. You have been transformed by the power of shadow. Come to me. Beware a shadow being. It approaches. As you can see, combat is pretty much handled the same way. But that's only a little bit different than regular Link's combat. But you'll see how soon enough. This time, it didn't require it at all. I find it interesting that these marks glow blue. spirits that protect Hyrule at the behest of the gods. I am Ordana, the black beast you slayed was a shadow being. It had come to seize the power of light I wield. My brethren in Hyrule have already had their light stolen by these fell beasts. The entire kingdom has been reduced to another world ruled by the cursed powers of darkness. Light will not stop with Hyrule. Before long, the entire world of light will fall into the hands of the king who rules the twilight. To save this land from the king of twilight, the lost light must be recovered. The three light spirits who have lost their light must be revived. There is but one who can revive them and redeem this land. You, you still have not discovered your true power. Those transformed by twilight usually cannot recover their original forms. Unless, if you were to return to Faron Woods where you were tra first transformed, if you were to revive the light spirit, there by the power of the light spirit, you may find the means to regain your other state of being. Oh, 
Alright, so now we've got to return to the other area. Why didn't you give me the fucking Tears of Light vessel, you fucking piece of shit? How am I supposed to collect Tears of Light without a vessel? Whatever. Let's keep going. Hey, look, the Farron woods that you know so well. They're now covered in twilight. You might not be able to come back here, but you still want to go? Oh boy, plan of no return. At least they warn you about it. My least favorite thing is point of no return. There are not optional. Like, they don't give you a choice. They don't warn you about it at all. Hmm, so these are the weapons you use in your world. You really think this thing can slay the creatures of Twilight? Well, I won't use these, but I'll hang on to them, to them for you. Alright, a promise is a promise. I trust you enough to help. In exchange for my help, though, I need you to gather some things for me. Look, I can't tell you all the details now, but it'll be easy, trust me. But enough about that. Do you hear that noise? It's the limitation of the spirit that had its light stolen. Where in the world could it be? Hee <laughs> hee. There you get going, don't you think? Don't blame me for your world's fate if you don't hurry up and find that light. Come on, snap to it. You are such a domineering bitch! I would hurry and get on with this game if you wouldn't keep interrupting me. Alright. I think this is where things get a little bit more interesting as the wolf link. Or should I say, a little bit worse actually. I've been hinting for a little bit here that wolf link's combat is a little bit different than normal link's combat. However, it's in the most tedious possible way they possibly could have made it different. Aw, we're penned in again. <laughs> Who do they think they're dealing with? No need to take these little pests on one at a time, right? You can take them all at once. So, you can handle this by yourself, can't you? Good luck. Bye! Weird. I hit them all at the same time and they didn't all die at the same time. I wonder why. What's the hold up? If you leave the last one alive, it's just going to use that shriek to bring the others back. Listen, let me help you out here. Just move like I tell you. You just told that be and I'll expand an energy field. So enclose all the enemies within it and release. Okay, now I can actually beat these assholes. And that's the only way that Wolfling's combat is different. If you kill all but one of the enemies, they all come back to life. It's not really harder than the regular form of combat. It's just a little bit more tedious because if you just accidentally kill too many enemies, you have to restart the whole battle. Please, be careful. These woods have changed. The dark clouds of dusk cover this land. This drape of shadows is called twilight. 
In this twilight, those who live in the light become as mere spirits. It is a place where the dark ones and evil creatures dwell. I am a spirit of light. Blue-eyed beast, look for my light. Retrieve the light stolen by the dark beasts and keep it in this vessel. You got the vessel of light. It's crucial to collecting the tears of light. If you fill it with the tears of light, you will be able to cut through the twilight and return normal light to this place. See these evils that hold the tears of light. Use your X senses. In the shadows of twilight, the dark insects are as invisible as normal beings are here. Let me use the last of my power to reveal the locations of the dark insects that consumed the light. Find the insects of darkness, the dark insects. They are the form taken by evil. Once it has latched onto our scatter light. Oh boy, it's everyone's favorite part of the game. That's one. That's two. That wasn't so hard, right? The thing is, the tears of light and the twilight gates wouldn't be so bad if there weren't so many of them. It just amounts to padding at the end of the day because of how much of it you have to do. But oh well, what's a Zelda game without some form of padding, right? Alright, that's three of them. Wait a minute, I just realized I left one alone. I have to go back. Hmm, looks like we can get in there. Oh yeah. Let's break into people's houses, like the true heroes we are. What's with these bugs? Those things aren't normal. They're so big, so weird, so creepy. Come on, get away, bugs. Shoo, get out of here. And that was easy. What? They just died? Oh boy, I have no idea what's going on around here. Alright, let's get out of here. I saved him. He doesn't need to know what's going on. Alright, here we are again, inside of this cave that I abruptly left because I forgot some bugs. Kill something. That's the most peaceful resolution for saving the world. Alright, I already went to that branch of this cave. So nothing new in this cave for me to find. It's purple mist. Obviously a good idea to go into that. Hey, think we can get across over here? Well yeah, I already knew we could. Why else did I go to the only area that could possibly get me 
forward through this mist. Wait a minute, I just realized I'm good at getting bugs. Whatever, I have to go all the way around because of skipping some bugs. I'm good at remembering things about this game. I'm just making things take longer and be more complicated than they really need to be. Alright. Looks like we made it through this area without a hitch. Here's some more bugs. An interesting reward. Come on, you stupid bug. Come back here. I killed one of them. What is this? King Boom Boom? Boom Boom or Boom Boom. I don't remember what it was, but in Sonic Adventure 2, there was a boss that hid under the ground as a shadow, and you had to dig into him to uncover him. Alright, let's get that bug that I missed. Come on! Alright, we'll be back after these messages of me returning to where I was, because I was done.